was heartbreaking watching not go through, so I can't imagine how it must have felt for you. I mean, you're in the beautiful surroundings in St Lucia and then to be told that. Yeah, it was it was quite hard. Um, more having to go home and tell your family that you didn't get through, but um, I'd met amazing people, I'd learnt so much and achieved so much, so I was really proud of how far I got. Um, I'm just happy I'm here as a wildcard. How were you preparing yourself then for the live shows? Um, just. St staying true to myself, working hard, um, making sure I don't let no one down and hopefully people pick up the phones and vote for me. Did you get some downtime with Talisa and to be able to hang out and tell me about that? Um, yeah, she's she's been in to see me, um, just telling me like tips, just uh, stay myself really and just keep being who I am and make sure I work hard and, and yeah, just enjoy myself. So. What's been the best part of this ride for you? Best part is like meeting new people. Um, everyone around me is amazing. We feel like a family. So, as much as we want to get through, I don't want to see none of none of the other wild cards go. I mean, as I said to the boys just there, you know, people are saying it's really hard to choose. What are you going to do to make people want to vote for you? I'm just going to literally. It would mean the world to me for the public, especially, to vote me in because then it's them who want to see me and them that believe in me so I'm just I'm literally just going to work so hard and and try to prove to everyone that I deserve this place. <laughs>